on API management, does a telco have any kind of specialized needs? Or is, it, or is a generic API management platform good enough for a telco? So the question is like if you want to take part in a fundraise, whether you go, would get a normal Honda Civic can take part or you go for Ferrari. Now telco is like that if you are running a telco operation, API management is something very similar to running a fundraise. You have to look for performance, telco, telco grade uh, uptimes, and the security. You have to protect your infrastructure from all the hackers and intruders. So it's a specific need. And uh, for that specific need, uh, you need uh, telco specific API management platforms, which aligns uh, your workflows, uh, operational uh, processes, and uh, security requirements uh, in a customized way. So that's my take. Like I mean, it's a very specific thing: the performance, uh, security, and uh, service level agreements are very different from normal API management systems. So telcos need very, very specific, uh, stringent uh, platforms tailor-made for that. So I, I, the the question is about uh, whether an operator or a telco should go to a a generic API management platform or whether they should actually look at specialized for Turco API management platform. So that's that's the question. So I think the important thing here is if you are going with the generic API management platform, you will not get what are very specific for telcos. So what are these? I think as an operator, you're responsible for the content and the services that are going to be developed. So you are governance it's a very important part of that. It's also important for you to have end-to-end -end security in your network, so you are not going to allow anybody to be able to uh, uh, use the network and you know have have you know certain amount of harmful things happening to your network. Third thing is, if you are actually important, is, is to look at how you would actually look at the monetization of the APIs, which means that you know it's not the number of API calls that you make is number of APIs that you expose out and how you would actually generate revenue through your subscribers. So if you look at it in that aspect, I think having a, a specific telco grade, telco specific API management platform is very important. Yes, and maybe I, I might finish with a joke, you know, I'm a native German and we have a German word which says, Eierlegende Wollmilchsau. So what there is that? There is an animal which is producing eggs, which is producing pork, which is producing milk, and which is producing wool. Yeah? So everybody wants to have that, but it doesn't exist. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, so I would say, if you are thinking of an API for a telco, you should look for the specific assets the telco has, the digital assets the telco has and leverage exactly them. So that other CDRs, and for example, as, as, as one of the examples, and they can be leveraged to a specific API, which is telco relevant. So not going, I would not recommend a telco to go for IR laying the volume itself. <laughs> All right. So, and uh, if, if telco start with the common platform, sooner or later they have to anyway build that uh, telco specifically on top of that. And that is a huge loss of investment because you spend on something that you don't want and you know not uh, and specific. And, and also you have to build it on maybe a lot of internal knowledge you have, not from the best practices of that very specific uh, telco grade API management systems have been built on. There's a hidden cost also into that.